The United Nations have put out a number of about 2.1 billion people that do not have safe water in their homes. And this problem is actually growing. What we find in many rural communities is that boreholes are being put in quite a lot. But they still need to move the water from the borehole back into their home. It's that last mile that we'd be focusing on. Simple ideas changing lives. That's really what our byline is. Around half of South African households do not have water piped into their homes. It's often women and children who have to travel to collect it. Hippo Roller helps people transport water more quickly and easily. My name is Grant Gibbs and I'm the founder of the Hippo Roller Project. Access to clean water is a human right, there's no question about that. It's one of the main SDG goals. Water is required for so many things, things that we take for granted, drinking, cooking, growing vegetables, things like that. The important thing to note is that without water, you can't wash, you can't clean. So that impacts on your hygiene. Hygiene impacts on your health and people tend to be sick unnecessarily just because they don't have access to water. Water is extremely heavy. So these are typically done in 20 litre or 25 litre jerry cans or open buckets. So you can just imagine the time that it consumes every single day. What we've also experienced is that it's mostly the youth that have that task of collecting water. So children get up early in the morning and the first task for the day is to go off to the water point, wherever that is, could be kilometres away, carry their empty buckets, go and fill them up and then bring it back home. A lot of them do miss a lot of their education which impacts on the chances of graduating and then being able to find employment after that. So it's a really a lifelong handicap. We see the Hipparola as an appropriate solution, appropriate technology to solve the water access problem. My name is Warwick and I'm a project manager at Hipparola. So aside from the obvious benefits being human health, productivity and obviously dignity, the main benefit of the HIPAA role is that it provides a flexible infrastructure for users to really improve their own lives. It could be distributing water to other individuals in the community that are maybe not physically capable of doing so. For instance, the disabled, the elderly. It provides an opportunity for unemployed youth that are looking for job opportunities to go and deliver that water for them. My name is Ryan Gibbs. I'm head of operations for HIPAA Rola. So here we have a 90 litre drum. This is our cap that we use in the hip roller. It's wide enough for us to be able to get our hands inside and clean the inside of the drum. That is often a problem for the 20 litre jerry cans where you can't clean inside and it builds up mold and bacteria. Outside of its core uses, every project reveals a new opportunity for the hip roller to be used. This could be from irrigating food gardens to manufacturing bricks. And I think that's the point of it is that it starts with water but it goes on to be so much more beyond that. Even beyond its lifespan to transport water, the durability of the plastic and components used allow it to be adapted for an array of other uses. They've been cut in half and then used as water troughs for baths or feeding animals, for growing plants inside, and whatever else they can actually come up with. The product is valuable to them even beyond its own lifespan. We've been distributing hippo rollers for 27 years now. We've reached 51 countries, we've distributed at least 60,000 units. We work on an average direct beneficiary level of seven people in the household, but quite often we find in more rural communities there are a cluster of homes, so you might be benefiting 20, 30 people from one HIPAA roller. So the impact is very, very large. Unfortunately, one of the issues with the HIPAA roller is cost. The end user who needs a HIPAA roller quite often is not able to purchase it. We recognise that if we can scale up the business by regional, local manufacture, we'll be able to keep the cost down because once you've added shipping, added customs cost duties, by the time it reaches the end user, it's quite large. And it makes it difficult for funders to afford to fund. Our growth is determined a lot by the partnerships that we're able to develop partnering with other organizations that have feet on the ground, understand the community and what their needs are, and help with the distribution of rollers and also accessing funding. The world is certainly changing fast enough, but the necessary change around it is not. 
The change I would like to see is more people getting involved in these kinds of projects and really understanding the struggles that people have. We would like to reduce that number of people that do not have access to water by 1%. That would take 12,000 hippo rollers every month for 10 years just to reach 1%. So it gives you some idea of the scale of the problem and the need and the demand that is out there. Access to water is a global problem and the hippo roller is a global solution. With the right partnerships, we can really make a difference and change millions, if not billions, of lives.